Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how to use Girvan Numa method for community detection. So uh, this method is actually used bitwitness centrality, and the edge which is having highest bitwitness centrality, that edge is removed, and this process will be continued until there is no edges remaining graph. So here we are going to write code for that. So first of all, we need to import iGraph library. Second thing, I'm going to read a quadratic data set uh, that I have already downloaded and uh, in JML format. So I'm going to write graph read GML. Now next, uh, in order to use this method, uh, there is already a function available in this library. So what you need to write, you need to write uh, g dot community h between us. So what this will do, it will create a dendrogram. So let's uh, print this t. What is this t? And we will run our code. So, if you can see uh, this dendrogram is created now, uh, if you want to calculate modularity of this partition, so in order to do that, first we need to fetch clustering information from this dendrogram. So, how you can fetch that? You can write d dot as clustering now. If you print P, so you can see which partition is having which nodes. So you can see uh, there are four partitions and uh, sorry, five partitions, and uh, these are the following nodes. Now, let's say we want to calculate modularity. So in order to calculate modularity, we need clusters which we have already paged in this line. Next, uh, we are going to use modularity. We will pass this partition here and here we will print Q. So this is the value for given human method for karate data set. This is the modularity value. Thank you very much for watching.